Ah, Brock, I've just got off the phone with your agent, and I think we'll be able to strike a deal. Fabulous. <laughs> yes, well, the other negotiations all about you. No, I'll tell you later. Hi, Brock. Darling, you look spectacular. Oh. Which makes me look even better. Oh. <laughs> Brock, I want you to meet my best friend, Valerie Torriello. Go ahead, Val, embarrass me. Oh, Mr. Storm, it's such a thrill to shake your hand. Was it as good for you as it was for me? <laughs> Two seconds. That's a record. <laughs> well, I hope I dressed okay, Brock. I didn't know what we were doing. Anything you want. Oh. Mon amour, mon amour. <gasps> Take a picture. Take a picture. Is it just me, or is he the phoniest human being on Earth? Would that be counting Miss Babcock? Oh, Mr. Sheffield, this is the most exciting night of my life, and I owe it all to you. Oh, you don't owe me anything. Don't owe him anything, either. <laughs> Nothing is owed. Don't wait up. Is everything all right, sir? Hmm? Oh, of course. She seems fine with the arrangement. Indeed. She was floating on air. Hot air, I might add. Sir, are you worried that she'll have a bad time or a good one? You know, Niles, you're starting to get on my nerves. <laughs> All in a day's work, sir. <laughs> that was a delicious meal, wasn't it? Who well, knew no happy hour could be so filling? Do you think my hair looks better parted on the right or the left? Well, let's see. You had it parted on the left for the nachos, and then you switched it for the buffalo wings, am I right? Uh -huh. Why don't you split the diff and part it down the middle? Uh, Khalib, there's my mansion now. Why don't you just drop me off at the corner? Driver, keep driving. What's your rush? It's a school night. It's the shank of the evening. And your eyes beckon me to the shore where I will crash upon your lips. You said the same thing to Nurse Judy, and now she's hanging on an IV pole. Well, it's time for some intensive care. And the doctor is in. That's it. You know, I have a good mind to report you to Soap Opera Digest. You are nothing like Dr. River Shane. No, but I'm exactly like his evil twin. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>